A recent article stated that multiple witnesses saw a UFO over Hawaii. This opens up the topic if aliens and UFOs exist or if there is life on other planets. And how does the Bible relate to this? What we do know is that God is the creator of all things as it says in Acts and that the earth and mankind are God's unique creation as we learn from the book of Genesis. We know that since the fall of Adam, all creation now suffers under the curse. So if there is life on other planets, they would suffer as well. Death was brought into existence and even animals, though they have no personal sin before God, will eventually die. And Romans 8 tells us that all creation waits for this future glory of God and freedom from the curse, when the wolf will once again lay with the lamb and there will be peace throughout. So is there life on other planets and does it matter? To answer the first question, we don't know, but most likely not. Men have sent spacecraft to nearly every planet in our solar system and have ruled out all but Mars and possibly a moon of Jupiter as being able to support life. In 1976, the USA took samples of sand from Mars and found no signs of life. They've taken more samples since then and always have the same results. In contrast, soil from the most barren desert on Earth to the most frozen dirt in Antarctica is teeming with microorganisms. The Bible gives us no reason to believe that there is life on other planets, but even if there were non-moral or non-sentient life forms existing, it wouldn't do real harm to any biblical text. It would, however, create problems when trying to answer questions like, since all creation suffers, what purpose would God have in creating non-moral, non-sentient creatures to suffer on distant planets? So what about all these so-called UFO sightings and alien encounters people have spoken of? There's no doubt that strange things have been seen in the sky and people have had similar experiences with so-called alien encounters. There's a million different theories on this topic and I'm just going to share my simple opinion. I think aliens are demons, fallen angels, or some form of Satan's servants, and that UFOs may be a combination of something from Satan and or from world leaders that are being used to deceive. TV is great for programming and conditioning us for what's to come. And with the amount of alien movies we see, combined with superheroes and supervillains and their powers, not to mention combining these with DNA to create super beings, I think we're getting a taste of what the Antichrist will be offering. Even the Pope said that he'd baptize aliens, and a Vatican scientist says it's okay to believe in aliens. Satan has been given temporary power in this world, and you know he's influencing a lot of what's going on. One of the New Age beliefs speaks of a kind of rapture, only it's going to be removing all the bad people. So when the actual rapture does happen and we are removed, it will seem to them like the earth is being purified from all those judgmental and intolerant people. A study in 24 countries showed that nearly half the population believes in aliens. So why wouldn't Satan use them as a tool to deceive people? Who knows, maybe the Antichrist will make contact with one of these so-called aliens that is offering powers to people to help the world, and that will all tie into taking the mark of the beast. I see this as a definite possibility. But if you are saved through Christ, then none of this will be a surprise when it does happen. And for the most part, we don't have to be concerned about aliens or UFOs. So as always, leave your thoughts and comments below, and until next time, take care and God bless.